Howdy there, buds, and welcome back to Ask Hazel. In the last episode, we had some feelsy family stuff, and oh, I, uh, Cuphead has won Father of the Year, in my opinion, right now. So, um, <laughs> yeah. Anyway, for this episode, we're just gonna have some random little skits, because, um, why not? That's all I can really explain this as. <laughs> so, anyways, without further ado, on to the diddly darn dub. Hazel, please boop Connor's nose. Boop. <laughs> hey, Hazel, I'm also a girl around your age. Have you hit the thing yet? You know, the P-E-R plus I-O-D? If so, how did your mom and dad react? To see, that would probably make my day. Oh, that. Well, yeah, I did get it when I was 11. Dad didn't take it too well. He thought I was literally dying. Becca, call 911. Hazel is bleeding and she is in pain. I think she's dying. Hurry up! Oh boy. <sighs> Cuphead, honestly, you reach a fine line between naive and stupid. And sometimes, I don't know which one you'll be in. Hazel, besides the ever painful traps of the period, what other changes have you noticed? I don't mean to be anything perverted. I just mean, have you gotten your finger laser stronger? Can you turn into a wolf faster? Are you better flyers? Stuff like that! Well, I definitely have more ability in controlling my laser. Throws a Mickey plush at Hazel. Mickey Mouse is on the house! <laughs> Has Hazel ever been bullied? If so, what did Cup and or Becca do? Why do you play with a cat plushie when you're 13? Plushies are for babies! Maybe she is just an oversized baby, huh? You're right! She even cries like one! What was that? Uh... Hey Hazel, I have something for you. Gives cupcakes and hug. You're welcome! Thanks! Can you please draw a comparison of when Hazel and Cuphead found out Becca, I don't know if I spelled that right, was pregnant with Connor? That's amazing to hear, Becca. I can't wait to meet them. Yay! Zul, so what's your favorite thing about Connor? Everything. Zul, so what do you want to be when you grow up? An artist. Aw, isn't Hazel just the cutest little marshmallow ever? Oh, she needs to be protected so badly. She is one of the most precious characters I've ever dubbed. How would Cup react if someone tried to kiss Hazel? Wh what do you want? Back up. What's Hazel's favorite thing to do when bored? Drawing, playing games, running around, watching TV, playing with my family, you know, stuff like that. Does Hazel like Pokemon? If so, throws a Pikachu plush at Hazel. Take it, my child! Hi, Hazel. I love your hair. Aw, thanks. Hi, Hazel. How you doing? What's up, Hazel? Wanna use my skateboard? Give skateboard. Thanks, but I ain't too great at skateboarding. Hello, cutie. I have a question about those hooligans. Does that happen often? Not as often anymore, but it still happens. <gasps> I will not stand for this. I am grabbing my bat, and we are going to pull a Walking Dead thing. I'm going to be a Negan for a moment, and I'm going to bring my Lucille's. I'm going <laughs> to... I'm gonna name him like Xavier or something, and I'll be like, Eeny, Meeny, Miney, screw it, both of ya. <laughs> that thing. <laughs> okay, that got really out of off track, so <laughs> my bad. What were to happen if I drank out of your cup like head, Hazel? It seems like all the cup characters get this question, and I feel so bad for them. Save the cup characters! <laughs> Uh... Nope! I want to drink out of Hazel! Where is your mother? No... All of a sudden, it rains tacos! Tacos for everyone! What? Shh, Hazel, shh, 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 just let it happen. Let it happen. Let it happen. It's okay. Just let it happen. No! Don't drink out of her! Yells for Cup. Someone's threatening Hazel! Hugs Hazel for comfort. Hazel, don't worry. I give you hugs and none of you try and drink out of Hazel or I will kill you! <laughs> Everyone get down! He has 
the spoon! Ah! Connor plus spoon equals Connor the legendary spoon master. Look out, it's a baby with a spoon and he ain't scared to use it! Nah! Hi Hazel, do you go to school? If you do, what grade? Yeah, I'm in seventh grade. 